Moa were very impressive and wide-ranging animals across Aotearoa, New Zealand, but what you may not know is just how species-rich the group was before they tragically became extinct, as our hand. There were nine of them in total, and in a quick-fire manner, these are them, all equally amazing and unique in their own right. First up are the North and South Island giant moa, belonging to the family Deinornithidae, the two largest of the group by a long shot, standing up to 3.5 metres tall, with them also both having some of the most extreme body size dimorphism of any birds, with the females weighing more than twice as much as the males. Next up is the most species rich family, Emiidae, comprising six of the nine species, which includes the bush moa, only slightly bigger than a turkey, alongside the eastern moa, an abundant coastal species on the South Island. There was also the stout-legged moa, plentiful in most of New Zealand's lowlands, with around half of all moa eggs being thought to be known from them. The heavy-footed moa were also very stocky, Mantell's moa being only found in the North Island, and the crested moa, a species that has so far been the only one not found in Maori food middens, and potentially had some kind of elaborate head plumage. And finally, there's the upland moa, the only member of the family Megalepta rigidae, which evidently from their name could be found living well up into the upper ranges of Aotearoa New Zealand's mountain ranges, with them also having some of the most well-preserved specimens assigned to them, due to their habitats being a great place for long-term preservation of soft tissues. If you want to learn more on moa, be sure to check out more content on them by searching these hashtags shown here, as other content creators and artists are also putting out moa-related videos for this month.